Hi, welcome to Kindred Spirit Readings. Let's begin Taurus. So there is a lot, uh, and this was quite intense for me coming through, but I am noticing that a lot of you are testing the waters now. Uh, whether you're aware of this or not, if you weren't happy with something or you weren't completely certain about someone else's intentions, this is coming through for you this week in a very powerful I want to say confronting way, but it's your presence, I want to say, that is going to be one of which is obvious to not only yourself, but to those around you, your environment, or whether that be at work, or whether that be in the home, uh, so there is that to consider also. There are a lot of questions being raised right about now in terms of where you see yourself, your status, your position in life, and I think a lot of where this stems from is, is having been hurt in the past, and making amends, and you're all about building a new foundation, um, you're all about restructuring, uh, creating solid, a solid lifestyle, a solid foundation for yourself. Now, if we look back seven years, I'm seeing seven years ago to where you once were, to the person that you have become today, there has been a shift. There's been a change within yourself. You've just simply had enough of the same old patterns or the same old way of thinking and you're ready. You're ready to make a change, but you're doing this with caution. You're being very careful as to who you welcome into your circle, into your uh, certain parts of your life where you see yourself manifesting in ways that brings newness into your life uh, for you. So this could crush a few people. Um, I am seeing that there is a lot of tension in the air at the moment with you having all sorts of uncertainty. You could be changing your mind quite a lot. You might even find yourself switching sides almost frequently. And what I mean by that is there is this confusion around the way of uh, of your perception towards things and people and places. So you might have decided, okay, I want to catch up with an old friend of mine. I haven't seen them in a long time. It's been years, in fact. And then you get cold feet or something happens at last minute, you change your mind. So there is that happening in within your th thought process. Pardon me. Don't be alarmed if you find that this is uh, somewhat odd to you. It, it might feel that way. This is just your way of getting comfortable, uh, as strange as that may come across. Whether you're aware of this or not, it's nothing to be alarmed about. It, it is, in fact, probably one of the most healthiest things you could be doing for yourself, whether it's intentional or not, uh, because this is your intuition kicking in and telling you, okay, well, I really didn't feel the need to do A, B, and C. In fact, I'd much rather do something completely different to the norm. So if you find yourself doing this, as I said, this is all about intuition. This is all about recognizing truth about yourself, truth about your environment, feeling comfortable within yourself to be able to say no to people that you constantly say yes to. That's another really important part of the week for you is that for a long time, there was too much people pleasing. So now you're taking back your power. This is all about taking that back and rather than always being readily available, you simply don't have to go along with what everybody else is doing or you simply don't have to go along with what was once a part of your life. You're now ready to make a change, but this is the kind of change which is occurring in the most strangest ways. As I said, very strange. This all may seem and play out for you. Uh, things work in your favor. Finally, you're, you're, you're seeing the light at the end of the tunnel. Don't be afraid of it because this is your body, your mind, your soul uh, taking over in ways that you may feel as though you have no control over your actions and your words, but you're in fact more powerful than ever. And you'll notice that you're speaking your mind a lot more and there's more truth to what you're saying, which is great. Thank you, Taurus.